Welcome to Global News Today. Please subscribe and check notification box to get all breaking news alert. A shocking video has gone viral showing a Palestinian American woman confronting U.S. President Donald Trump supporters who allegedly called the woman's 5 year old cousin a terrorist. The video, which was shared on Twitter, showed one man and two women arguing with a woman, a teenage boy and a young girl on a street in Los Angeles, California. The woman, identified as Ron, told the raw story that the confrontation happened on Sunday the 10th of December. The child was standing holding a dump Trump placard when the trio started abusing her. All the three Trump supporters were seen wearing shirts in support of the president. Can you say it on video, please? You called my five-year-old cousin a terrorist, the Palestinian American woman can be heard saying in the video. To which the Trump supporter, identified as Johnny Turano, replied looks like one. It doesn't matter what age you are. Yo you're calling a five-year-old, a terrorist, Ryan can be heard saying in the clip. Ryan was then interrupted by Turano's daughter, Bianca, who said but this is America, we can say whatever we want. Yo you're exercising your freedom of speech. We're exercising our freedom of speech. Bianca also took her own video in Rowan's recording, which was soon uncovered and shared online. In the footage, she can be heard saying, you guys are terrorists, get out of here. If you hate America so much leave. The teenage boy who was with Ryan at time responds to that and yells, I don't hate America, I just hate inaudible FCKS like you. In Bianca's recording, all Trump supporters can be heard abusing other pedestrians also as Toronto yells, you can suck my DK pay less than an American 5 year old called terrorist by Trump supporters Twitter earlier in 2017, Toronto, who goes by the nickname based Spartan, told the Vanguard, he regretted becoming involved in a so-called outright movement after he met some people that seemed so nice. Turano had said he thinks that discrimination he sees Latinos face in Southern California is spearheaded by the outright.